Hey guys! Well, for a few days now, the Save Ralph video has gone viral. Maybe you have come across it in your feed, in your Instagram stories, or maybe even on Twitter. But what's behind Ralph the Rabbit? In this video, we will analyze a short film that has gone around the world and tells us a sad reality. Every day we see thousands of cosmetics and beauty products and these serve us in the day-to-day, -day, but at what cost? There is a sad reality behind these products and every product you can see on your bathroom and this has been exhibited like never before thanks to Ralph's short film and the sharing tool that is Instagram. The short film is presented under the premise no animal should die and suffer in the name of beauty. We can see the day-to-day -day life of Ralph, a rabbit, like a kind of documentary. He describes his work and how he suffers greatly because of these tests. He tells us that he can no longer see through his right eye and nor listen by his right ear. He is very tired and you can see his deterioration. He tells us that this is his reality and that his whole family has been through the same work. He even knows he will die performing it. Ralph admires humans for their achievements, but as an animal, he must accept the role he has to play in this life and, of course, the superiority imposed by humans towards animals. These industries hide the suffering to which millions of animals are subjected each year. It is necessary for a product to be endorsed or approved to be marked. These products should go through various tests to see if they are harmful to humans' health or not. Millions of animals are victims of this process. These various animals serve as guinea pigs to test the effectiveness or nociveness or nocivity of such products and well. And you can see that the word we are using is guinea pigs, an animal. But okay, at the end of the short film, we see Ralph with an orthopedic neck and injuries throughout his body caused by the amount of chemicals they have been using on him. This has caused him to go totally blind. The video is made in stop motion. Director, writer and comedian Taika Waititi, who also lent his voice to Ralph, is the mind behind the film. It also features actor Zac Efron as the presenter, who we never get to see. This short film wants us to think that animals are still suffering from cosmetic industries and it's kind of like time to come together to ban this practice globally. This initiative by International Humanitarian Society seeks to curve animal testing and curb abuse. It states that this practice has been involved for more than a hundred years where big brands are involved. The vast majority of these brands are beauty and hygiene products. Some are mentioned and those are L'Oreal, Johnson & Johnson and Procter & Gamble (P&G), among others. But as you can see, these products are almost basic to us and we consume them as if it was just kind of like life, right? Well, like life for Ralph in this case. We could prevent that from happening ever again. There are many brands that are cruelty-free right now and all we have to do is check the product we are about to consume before paying for it. Just check if they are cruelty-free. This is a minor action that can change millions of lives. This short film stole everyone's heart. They are called upon to sign the petition of International Humanitarian Society to stop animal testings. Products containing curand and free or animal cruelty-free seals means that they do not test in animals. These are backed by organizations such as PETA, yeah, we know, so we can bring about economic change and impact on animals abuse industries to change their policies. If we consume them, they will still go for cruelty-tested animal things. And if you want us to bring a second part of this video, please leave a comment so that we can know. And if you like this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more updates every time we upload a new interesting video. I've been thinking about making a video about James Charles case. Would you like that? Just let me know down in the comments. My name is Ravinian and remember, you are here.